everyone it's raquel of raquel's carbon cuisine and today i am going to be making a creamy pot of cornmeal porridge this is definitely a comfort food and when i tell you about rich smooth creamy quick and easy and so absolutely tasty to my pot i have three cups of water boiling and to that i'm going to be adding three bay leaves these bay leaves gives this part so much more flavor cinnamon stick or cinnamon leaves could also be used here i have one pack of cornmeal i'm going to mix about one cup with about two cups of water i'm going to mix that well and this is going to be added to the boiling pot of flavored water make sure the cornmeal is dissolved within the water and then there's a tatty here while the mixture is being added to the pot stir constantly stirring this will prevent any lumps stir until this becomes thick and smooth and at this point reduce the heat to its very lowest cornmeal porridge have a high source in fiber protein iron a bowl of this for breakfast will last you throughout the whole day and not to mention this is so so delicious After the part have become thick, just cover and allow to cook for about 20 minutes and store occasionally within that time frame. This is the consistency we are looking for. Thick and smooth. Really nice and smooth. now it's time to sweeten here i have one pack of vanilla flavored lasco and this is totally optional it's not a must but when i tell you this vanilla lasco give this porridge that extra boost in flavor oh my goodness and it is rich in protein calcium and iron as well i think this is a must try Adding about quarter cup to a container with about one cup of full cream milk and mixing that together. And you can use any milk of your choice, whether it be almond, evaporated milk, coconut milk, any milk content. And the milk will loosen the thickness of the porridge a bit. And this is where you're going to add the amount of milk depending on how thick you want your porridge. My kids and I love when it's a bit thick. The more milk is added, the less thick it would be. Mixing that in and this is real creamy and smooth. Yes, man, this is how it should be. And by this point, um, your stove should be off. Adding some salt, some condensed milk, and mixing that in. Also, some vanilla essence, and this is smelling so good. Also, going in with some brown sugar. And you may ask why condensed milk and sugar they both are sweet but let me tell you this the cane sugar give this porridge a great flavor just add and sweeten to your taste and last but not least some grated nutmeg and that's it it's ready a creamy flavorful pots of comfort food delicious bowl of cornmeal porridge i grew up on this for breakfast with a slice of buttered bread oh my goodness nostalgic memories my kids are going to enjoy this so much thank you my mommy you're very welcome my baby 
thank you so very much for watching guys full ingredients amount will be in the description box please don't forget to subscribe and give me your thumbs up also give me your feedback in the comment section i really hope you enjoyed this video bye